Hey, hello everybody, I am Kush and today I'm gonna play some games from Ludum Dare 32 once again. The first game is Kill Next <coughs> Sorry In this game you have to build a weapon to kill or to do as much damage as possible in this person I already played a little bit this game the idea is quite interesting as you remember the idea behind god damn it the team behind this Udum there was unconventional weapons <coughs> and in this game you build your own weapon so you can you can't get more unconventional than that. This you have to pick from these elements on the left. There isn't quite that much, and I don't know what this one does, to be honest. I have no idea. What the hell does it do? Let's see. Is it spinning? Oops. Might be spinning. Okay. So I'm just gonna build something as fast as possible. I'm gonna. So I'm. Be right back. You're gonna watch this. It's gonna be. I'm gonna speed this up. Be right back, guys. Okay, welcome back. Let's see what this will do. I have no idea. Okay, <laughs> hey, it's not working as, as intended. Uh, we try. God damn it. But I think this might be a good idea. So. Let's try this again. Oh god damn it, wrong one. Okay guys, be right back. Okay guys, welcome back. I call this one the Spanker. <laughs> okay, the idea behind this game is amazing. And I can see people... But the, I was about to say, I can see people doing a lot of crazy things. It's true that the you don't have that much elements to choose, but it's quite limited. But it's a great idea. It's kind of like a besiege, and I uh, I would like to see more of this game. Maybe doing a torture device, probably fun. But this is really good. 
and an amazing use of the unconventional weapon topic. So back back for the next game. Next game is Adventure Lamp. So you have, it's even as as a story I already beat this. This it's kind of demo. You know, it has like five levels. It's a really good game you're about to see. Aryu is an explorer with an obsession for ancient artifacts, it's caused a globe for bits of history and get it, it to all kinds of adventure along the way. Jesus, it's... <coughs> On one such adventure, our hero finds himself plum, pl plummeting. Jesus. Yep. I read like a five year old. Into the earth as the floor collapsed. Separated from his equipment, our hero has nothing but his wits and a rusty headlamp. So you are this cute and so cute little guy and your only weapon is your lamp red lamp and I have to say this has to be one of the favorites because this game is really well made the sound effect is amazing yeah and I fucked and the idea behind the we oh god damn it the weapon is a really good one and the level design is really good as well there's it's a platformer oh I should have done that and this oh, it's it's simple but it's well executed and this was made in 48 hours. So, oh! I really like this game. I already played this. Oh, no, 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 not you! This one, there's a quite variety of enemies. It's quite impressive. These guys follow you around. Can you please die? Not me! Him! As you are about to see, and the platforming is quite good. Damn it, I should have just. Shoot! God damn it, I fell. Give back my lamp. Kill him! Yes! Whoops! And you do have an unconventional weapon. Use your lamp. Oh my god, this guy. Okay, this guy fall follows you around, but only on death. At that height. Uh, nice. Hey. I would like to see this made it into a full game. How the hell did I miss that? Jump. There's a. There's already a good idea behind it. And if it's if it's more developed, you are probably gonna see it in green light. So really well made game. And I'm getting mad at it. Woo! Almost. Yeah. There's a really cute protagonist. Good. Oh boy. And yeah, you can aim the where the where your lamp goes. Uh, oh, oh, I was able to. Oh, no, 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 suicide. Oh fuck. Yes! Can you please leave me alone? Come on! Oh boy, not what I want to do. Not really what I wanted to do. I want to kill the one behind me. Come on! You have to juke him around a little bit. Uh, oh, shh! No. <gasps> yes! Yes, 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 yes. Oh boy, this is this is one of the last levels. I kind of mistaken. Oh damn it! 
Hey, to, for this game to be made in 38 hours, I'm quite impressed. YOLO! Oh, but, oh! Jesus! Oh, nice! Oops. Die! It's quite a lengthy game. So, that's it for Adventure Lamp. Be right back for the next game. Welcome back, this is Zombies Love Bread. So, it's a shooter, kinda. Yeah, where you shoot bread to kill zombies. So it's, again, the team for this Udum there was unconventional weapons. And I do like the idea behind it. There's one thing that I don't like, and it's the controls of this game. I really lucky and you oh they are quite fast these little bastards and they are smiling and because you use the I was saying the the controls are kinda clunky because you use the the arrow keys to move the camera around and move yourself. You use space to shoot and it just doesn't feel right, you know. It's really hard to control. It's probably really easy to get to get uh, to die. See, I mean, I'm just bad, but it's a really cool game. I I like the idea behind it. I like the aesthetic. Kind of looks like um, what was the game? It was like a DayZ in Minecraft. Oh boy. I don't remember. Uh, I really don't remember. Eh, doesn't matter. Good. It actually looks good. The sound effects are, are great. The controls are just... Eh, need some work. To, you should probably use the, the mouse to move the camera around. And you should walk a little faster. Or maybe get some upgrades, maybe you can get uh, upgrades, but to move faster, you are quite slow in this game. That's... And when you shoot, it doesn't feel that responsive, shooting the bread as the bread rolls around. But maybe that's the idea he had for shooting, and it's not that kind of, it's not that big of a deal, the shooting. The, the, the movement is, the controls are a, a big a big issue, but looks really good. And I know who did the game, but he had a great idea. And that's it for this episode of Voodoo There. Hope you guys enjoyed. Maybe I will do some more. It's 10 days that for the competition to end. Don't, don't you guys forget to vote for your favorites. What games would you like me to play? What games did you play and liked? I am Kush, once again thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and drop a like, see ya!